As a head-end technician, I am responsible for the facilities, the environmentals, implementing new projects, upgrading old equipment, and replacing defective equipment. My name's Pete, and I'm a head-end technician with Comcast. Typical day for me, stop, grab a cup of coffee along the way. I'll head into Long Beach Island, stop off at the service center, and meet with the line techs, Al and Bob, and see if there's any issues that came in overnight that they're dealing with, any problems out in the field, uh, anything that I can check here in the head end that could maybe, you know, help solve their problem that they're working on. So whatever it may be, that way at least in the morning we can go through scrub calls and yeah. or at least let the guys know, you know, be aware of it. If we do find any issues, um, I'll start investigating them on the head end side. Later, guys. From there, I'll head down to the Long Beach Island head end. From this head end, we provide service for approximately 20,000 homes. When I get here, I boot up the computer, all that fun stuff. One of the other things I do is a complete channel check to make sure our test and monitoring equipment hasn't missed anything, make sure every channel is coming in right. Then I'll do a check of the facilities, look for any alarms uh, in my HVAC, the transmitters and receivers, the CRAN, the CMTS, the DC plant, and our UPS. If we're good, I'll start working on whatever project that we may have planned. I'm getting ready to start running some cables, uh, CAT6 cables, for the new uh, MX960 project acceleration upgrade that we're doing in Long Beach Island. Uh, attention to detail is everything in the head end. We spend a lot of time to make sure that our sites never get shut down. Shooby-doo.